how can ICTs put a stop to sexual harassment in Egypt? At HarassMap, we use uh, an online approach combined with an offline approach. So we take digital tools and mobile phones and we use them in combination to improve and support our offline traditional community work. So we gather evidence of harassment from victims and witnesses by crowdsourcing reports of what happened to people and where. These reports uh, get mapped on a map of Egypt and are published anonymously on our website. Um, and we take this information when we go into communities, or actually when we train people to go out into their own communities and talk to people in their neighborhoods who have a presence in the streets and are able to decide what's tolerated and what's not in their own communities. And we use this information to strengthen our argument and to motivate them to get active. So uh, there are some stereotypes that people always have about sexual harassment that prevents them from taking action when they witness harassment. It prevents them from taking the risk and getting involved and intervening and telling the harasser that their behavior isn't tolerated. So with this data that we collect, we're able to show them that these stereotypes are wrong, that it's not how women are dressed, that it is a problem in their neighborhoods, that it's not flirting, that it's not an issue that's exaggerated, um, and that it has nothing to do with sexual frustration, that it's an issue of violence and aggression. And when we take this information to people, it changes them. It, when they read it, they might have um, an impression that you know, these, these stereotypes might make them insecure about taking the risk of intervening and possibly getting into a fight or a confrontation with someone. But after they realize the severity of this problem, they can't do that anymore. They, they can't, they're so deeply touched by the first person reports that they can't remain silent. They feel they really need to, to stand up to harassers and to stop this problem because it's not a problem that goes together with Egyptian values or traditions or history. This is something new and it's something against all of the, the Egyptian values. So it's a really motivating way to bring people in society together to stand up to this problem.